with Project Zomboid becoming my favorite game, I figured it's about time we start to do an actual let's struggle on this game. Essentially a let's play, but it's all edited. We got a bunch of mods in it. I want to just try and make it fun. With that, what mods are we using? Well, we're using a bunch actually. Let me go to solo and show you. As you can see, it's over a full page of mods. There's a lot of good stuff in here, a lot of vehicles, there's a uh, some map expansions. There's uh, not too much that'll make the game crazy, crazy different. Let's go with Riverside. Riverside I know the most, so it'll be good to start there. I'm going to go and set it to no respawn, so the zombies cannot respawn in this. Because one, I am trash at the game, and I would like to feel that immersive feeling of clearing out a neighborhood and it being clear. And two, there's plenty of zombies in the game, so I'm not too, too worried about about finding zombies. Now we've got our traits that we can pick. I've got to go for all my negatives first. All right, I've got a good amount of negative perks that gives us 55 points to spend. First, I'm gonna grab police officer so that we can actually shoot the zombies with guns. We'll have to eat a lot to start the series off, but at least eventually we'll lose that and then only have these negative perks. We're looking good, and now we can create our character. I wanna make a uh, island boy or something like that. <laughs> I guess that's what this hairstyle is now. We'll name this guy Mr. Blister. He got that name in high school after sleeping with one too many girls under the football stands. And it has stuck with him for the entirety of his life. Uh, well, just, just like for blisters. <laughs> hey, that's fucking gross. I think we're ready though. We can hit play. Let's start this let's struggle. Alright, click to start. Let's begin. Oh, this one's not horrible. We turn down the TV, put it to life and living, get our first TV show in. We do have an extra button for inventory so we can see everything that we have on us like this. Other than that, game is pretty normal. I mean, we got first aid for beginners and fishing for beginners. That's pretty good. We already got a cooking to level one and it's been like no time at all. All right, so if you never played Project Zomboid, right now we got to watch the TV until it ends. Then we're going to loot this house and leave this house. The first like nine days or so, we have TV shows that give us uh, experience points like every six hours. So I'm going to try and watch all of those. I'm ripping this tank top for some bandages. That way if I get another blister, it won't uh, cripple me for life. Mr. Blister has to be very careful. He already has fucking blisters on God knows where. So getting a zombie infection will definitely lower the chances of him finding a boyfriend free girlfriend. Can I still make Chris Chan jokes after what happened? Yo, we got two leather jackets. That's kind of pimping. Don't really see anything else in here come on i want to find like a weapon or something denim shorts how are these better than my pants i i guess sure uh maybe i should have put food to get ready to make well we do have ice cream i can eat that right now right now we have to like eat as much as we really can try to keep ourselves full that way our character will start to gain the weight back you can see he's already got one arrow we need two arrows and then it to be continuously like going up and then when we get to i think 75 or something we'll be good a rolling pin that's better than nothing i'll take that as well as the kitchen knife over is the garage please please ah oh. Oh, club hammer that's nice <gasps> crowbar that's even better yo okay we're set i thought we would have had a little bit of trouble to start with but it looks like we're not going to be doing too too bad okay i'm going to remember if there's other stuff in this house i might just come back here and stay in this house for the time being <laughs> There we go, first zombie kill. Good stuff. Now we gotta find a watch, which will probably be on a zombie. Ma'am, do you know what time it is? Ooh, I see a watch on her wrist. All right, you're getting mugged for it. I don't care if it's a Rolex or one of those shitty ones you got at Shoppers Drug Mart, I'm taking it. It's a digital watch too, that's really good. Now I do have to keep an eye out for a few other things. One, I need cigarettes um, because my guy is a smoker. I need to find a water bottle, a backpack. <laughs> There we go. See, right now, it's fine for us to take on about, like, three to maybe four at a time. Five is getting kind of dangerous, at least until we get some more experience, as well as, uh, we aren't very underweight. All right, I'll kill these two zombies and then go into this house, because, uh, our TV show is going to start soon. Whoa, that was close. I've got to try to not do that. <laughs> There we go. We're in now. I do hear a zombie somewhere. Oh, we're out here. All right, let's kill them. There we go. Both of those zombies are down. I do not hear another uh, zombie in here, so might be a good sign. Uh, there's another zombie right there, so I was wrong about it's that. Over, oh, there's two right there. Okay, let me turn on the TV, because uh, I would rather risk death than lose out on the first little bit of a carpentry show. There we go. We got a carpentry up. Let's go. Doesn't matter if there's zombies inside of a house. There we go. Both of them down. Oh, no. More zombies. I don't know if he's seen me yet, though. Oh, 
I don't think they have. Wait until I'm done my juice box. What an asshole, man. Oh, that's a barricaded house. Oh, okay, I definitely need to check that out. Um, there are zombies on that side. I don't know if I want to go in yet then. There we go. Oh, fuck. Ah! Uh, I hate that, man. I hate that. Is that a police officer with a gun? Okay, I gotta go get him first. That'll give me armor and then a weapon as well. Like, hell yeah. Hey, we got a long blunt up already. That's nice. Ooh, nice. A Colt M1911. Another gun. Oh, if two of them, that's really good. For the time being, I'm just going to throw, like, everything in one spot and then... S oh, sh I'll end up sorting it out, like, soon. If we're still alive by a few days in, that that's when I'll start to get to sorting. Here we go. We've been alive for, like, six hours, and we've almost eaten everything in this house and the house over. Let's go out for an adventure now. I want to go check out that house down here because it was barricaded a bit. It could have some weapons or, like, survivor stuff in it. This window would be ideal just because it's long hallway. All right, there we go. There's one. All right. I think that's it. Oh, here we go. Hand hatchet, a two by four cordless drill. Okay. This isn't too, too bad. I can take this stuff. I guess only the bedroom was barricaded. I mean, smart, I guess, but I don't know. That's pretty weird, bro. I haven't seen that. Oh, a fanny pack. Awesome, bro. Now I can wear this on the front and I have a little bit of extra storage. All right. Ready to go home now. We got uh, another like 20 pounds of loot, plenty of weapons, at least uh, melee weapons to get us started off with. <laughs> Why were you waiting there, man? That wasn't nice at all. That was fucked up. We're starting to get a little bit freaked out, a little bit uh, shaky because we really need cigarettes. I'm gonna sit on ground and have my guy read the fishing book for a while while the TV show starts to play. Ah, uh, the first show is fishing. Reading this book is probably like pointless, honestly. All right, let's run the hell out of here and continue to explore because I really do need to find cigarettes. We got Rick Ashley never gonna give you up. <laughs> Uh, that's um i'm not taking that all right it's another house down so we got that one that one and the third one down there looted and we're bringing it all back to this house i think up there like up this way is where the gas station is so i might start clearing zombies towards there because i know i'll find a lot of cigarettes at the gas station as well as gas which i definitely do need how to use generators that's pretty good oh dance for a shimmy oh yeah i want to figure out how to do that all right my guy's getting pretty tired now i think i'm gonna close these uh try to eat what i can and then i'm gonna go to sleep yeah my guy only slept like an hour that time he's panicked because we got no cigarettes so we woke up in a rage of fury i might as well go out start to loot the other houses that one might have a generator over there that would be pretty fucking rad dude come on please have a generator some cigarettes anything in here <gasps> yeah let's go boy Ooh, and an empty gas can i guess i'll put a whole gas can in my fanny pack let's take this bring it back to our place this is already looking to be a really good start we got weapons we got some food we got the generator already i've got a gas can so once i find some vehicles i can siphon gas like Corey and trevor did in trailer park boys All right, let's try it oh fuck there's a zombie right there cannot try going to sleep yet would be a bad idea oh fuck there's a few oh fuck there's a quite a bunch okay um escape and let's go around the corner get away from my house oh man they're all breaking in now and shit this is not good man a lot of them gathered up already ah! <laughs> i need to fight them more of a light or something dude oh my god this is such a mess. I got so many negative moods. It's making us take forever. Oh my god, this one zombie that's fucking crawling. I hate, I hate so much. Oh my god. That was disgusting. At least one of them has cigarettes. I just saw. Perfect. I'm gonna go back to my house and see uh, what the damages are. They've broken all around the house. Awesome. And there's still some in the backyard. Oh my god. How many hits? How many do I need? They completely broke my glass door. This place is not really safe to be at now. All right, maybe if I close all the doors and I close the curtains, I can um, possibly get some peace and should I? But first, I need to smoke a cigarette. We're already at 63 weight, which isn't horrible. Only um, another three pounds, and then we'll lose very underweight and just be underweight. See how we fare up against this zombie right here. Yeah, one hit, fall down, two hits, dead. Those other zombies were dead ass taking me probably like 10 to 15 hits 
each to kill because of how uh, depressed we were. <laughs> but we got an entire neighborhood to work through. I've got to go and make my way up here. Oh, there's a... Oh, a guy and a girl in here. <laughs> what are they doing? Fucking... Look, look how fast she tried to crawl to me. Man, you gotta get your girl. Why does he only have scissors on him? The fuck were they doing? Scissoring? <laughs> like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Poopy croc. I'll be here all year. Oh, what do we have here? Pasta. Two of them. I definitely am gonna make these. And these guys had stuff set. Water bottles, bowl of cereal, friggin' pasta, sex. This is the most lit house I found so far in uh, Project Zomboid. <laughs> these guys not have a TV? What the fuck? I, I take back my statement of that being the best house I've found so far. That house sucks. There we go. We got a little bit of carpentry experience. It looks like I haven't looted this house, so I might as well do that while I'm here. Come ah! Here. <laughs> There's a guy having a fucking bath in here. All right, well, we got this first container, like, full of different bullshit that we found. That's pretty good. We've survived a total of one day now, so that's really good. Give ourselves a pat on the back for that. Probably get going to sleep a little bit close these curtains and head to bed and then i think that's where i'm gonna end off this first episode of project zomboid but let's struggle most of the videos probably won't have an episode number in the title it'll probably be in the description so look out for the playlist on my channel to watch all the project zomboid videos in chronological order if this playthrough ends up dying on like day 7 or day 30 or day 100 whatever the case is we will just continue on with the new episodes and like a new character fuck ah, i'm in the bad house again and there's a tv show starting soon <laughs> i gotta run but leave any feedback that you guys have for the series or what you guys want to see in the videos remember the channel is still really early on so any feedback that i can get is really appreciated but hopefully you guys like these videos remember to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already or check out my other social medias in the description below i'll see you guys in the next one peace